of my tournament. That, that was really pretty. It was an interesting choice. It's interesting. This is gonna be interesting. It's an interesting choice. Interesting to see. This should be interesting. Interesting, interesting. Interesting. It is an interesting choice. It'll be interesting. Alright, this is ridiculous. Yeah. Yeah. Honestly. Oh, that's harsh. Most unfortunate. I just have to say that we might have more people commentating this stream than actually watching this stream. Alright. Got a pro strategy. Which might be a little unexpected for... Alright, we've got a tie. On to the third map. Map number three. I think all of us are in Archer's have an arrow in Looks like they've got a four, five cap. Looks like Serial missed the memo. It's a very nice rock TK has that. <laughs> Can is a cavalry for GK, so you never know, this could go both ways. <laughs> oh, Can, the hero oh, of the go. Golden Kingdom. If you'll notice, Can is at the top of the GK leaderboards. That's that's a very important observation, you guys pay attention to that. Um, oh, they gotta keep that archer alive. They really gotta keep that archer alive for GK. That's gonna be a big target, what Paz said. Well, yeah, there he goes. And he's and down. He's down. As long as Wapa plays this nice Yeah, and this Wapa machine. I got it. Man. Yeah, that is good. vicious. That calf coordination is perfect timing yeah. coming from all sides and not hitting each other. So, so Nordtown, Nords vs. Rodax, that's, uh, that's about, I, I don't think I've ever seen this matchup. What do you think we can expect here? Oh, uh, three versus down. one. And this appears to be game. Although there will definitely be an epic last stand. Is Skeptic Kush? Yeah. Yes. So it's not over yet. <laughs> no, it's not. It all comes down to that crossbow shot. A fight. a fight they'll give him. My oh. team wounding? No. <laughs> Twenty-five seconds till the master goes up in north. Oh, oh gee. Oh. He can stay alive for twenty seconds. They've got that flag. Up high enough to win, I Yeah, bet. Nords has the flag. Both are very good players here. Yeah, They're it looks like really Septic really is not even trying to attack. No, nope, he might even just pick up another shield. Um, or just win. That was or impressive. just win. One of the top teams before, so... They prevent God from catching up. Even infantry battle here. <laughs> Way too much going on to follow. GK. GK getting Taking a lot of out the Valiant. It's funny, wow. as soon as you see that like second kill. They give the archer shields, so that's gonna increase their survivability a lot, but they don't want to get into a shootout because they're gonna run out of arrows pretty quick. Yeah. The distance is short. Honestly, I don't know if shield helped that much against a cav heavy faction like Swadia. Because the biggest risk is going to be those Great Lances. That's the shields place. may not help that at all. I largely agree. I think a bigger uh, flaw, though, is Wapaw is really, really badly split. 
They have some guys in the middle room and some guys all the way over on the left. And they're gonna get picked apart. See, right now, Ruin or TMW, I mean, he's providing support for the archers by not letting the cab get close to him, but he's not doing anything because he's inf on, a, on an open map. Kind of questioning infantry. Internal's not watching his back. Two SWATI cav come behind on the out. And there you go. BKH is running one cav. And it looks to be five infantry and Crazy Boy is there. Papa's gonna meet him here in the middle. Hammer time. Yeah, well, Bob's He's working really uh, with that hammer. One yeah, heavy cast no across both the rest are in. Bob comes in really behind. up here. At the start, of the, they're a little closer together now, but man, they were split up at the beginning. Clockwise with a nice double kill. God with another count. Ooh, fuck, it's a TK. Those TKs really hurt. Seven on seven. Mark is having some issues though. I believe he's lagging, he's also freezing. Mark's also on map. Uh, KOH also has a cap. How many Enderthals up away from death? As long as I keep that cap open, I think they have it. Mm, might not keep that cap. Yeah, the crossbow's tucked away pretty well. Mock needs to push him. Oh, oh Mock goes wow. down. Oh. Ooh, great shot. You gotta get that cab down and take out a crossbow. And it's not happening. It's it's over. Looks like it's over. GK wins the match. GK came out and knew exactly what to do on this map and just and tore Valiant apart. Okay, predictions. Who do we think is going to win? Well, uh, during the round robin portion of my tournament, uh, it was a very close match. I think Wild Pop pulled out the victory. It was a very close one, though. As close as the presidential election? I don't know. I don't think it was that close. One of these days, they're going to pick a map. Oh god, they're pushing with crossbows, what are they doing? They're on the open, they're gonna pick up her here. They've got no range support against these archers. Their archers just need to run away, that's all they need to do. Once those crossbows have fired their shot, they're almost useless. They're less useful than infantry, in fact. I think they were a bit too aggressive there. Reckless, to be honest. Ooh, Craven just got pwned. Yeah, yeah that was fatal. Blade just won that round for Wapa. Come on, pick them up already. There's a bit of confusion on the rules. Let me guess, what I want to play, uh, planes. This is an amazing spectacle. All the players who are alive are now AFK. This is where everyone opens up their browsers and goes to look at the rules. Right. Does Wapa think you can have two open maps? You can. It's in the rules. Huh. This is a really bad time to read the rules for Valiant. <laughs> I 
I mean, it is Zero's team. Hello, everyone. This is the CJTT Finals. Yeah, Marna just theory crafts them to victory. <laughs> Red Knight is not going to be fighting with Wapa, at least not at the moment. He hasn't showed up. We think he may have gotten grounded. I'll say, if you put a good strat on the team that it's closer to the, to the church, and if you are able to defend the church area, you pretty much can uh, control the map. On the other side, on the castle, if you have a strong infantry team pushing towards there and taking over the, the church area, uh, you pretty much can take the map. So I guess it's about either playing defensive or playing offensive on this map. And on the end, it comes down to teamwork and um, and cap play because cap has a huge role in this one. West Knights are already coming around the back side of the church. They are realizing that it's not a good place to engage as cavalry. Too many obstacles, too many places that you're gonna get stuck. Oh, getting hit with the jabs. Those those lucky jabs that nobody has any skill with. Uh, looks like West Knights is going around the building a little bit here. And yeah, they're trying to get a flank on. Yep. You're gonna get them from both sides. Still, Got they're, they're keeping that defensive position near the buildings, which might be a advantage against Kev. Yeah, they got a pinch, but West Knights are just outnumbered in the melee. The Cavs. No. Yeah, I saw one West Knight, uh, 2v1. Seems like it's work. It worked though. Well, what you do is you just get 15 of them and just spam the jabs until eventually you hit something. It just really makes you want to rage quit sometimes. All right, guys, I'm going mountain climbing. Holy crap! Are you getting this fun or I made it? We've got it.